Hi, my name is Colin Flavin. And I'm Heather Souza, Principals of Flavin Architects. Welcome to the Wales House. The Wales House is a 1958 modernist house designed by Henry Hoover and Walter Hill. And we were tasked with transforming this mid-century house for a young modern family. Since there's a lot to see here, I'm gonna show you around the outside. And I'll take you in. There are three buildings that comprise this project. The carport building that we designed, a yoga studio that we renovated, and the original main house. Here you can see how beautifully Hoover adapted the house to the natural topography of the land. One of my favorite features is the entry stair that floats over the top of this existing glacial stone. So there's a beautiful respect for the natural environment. As soon as you step in, you immediately notice the design principles we embraced. Mainly it's open flow, natural light, and visual connection to the landscape. All throughout, we restored the tongue and groove paneling and the structural wood decking on the ceiling. The lighting that links this dining area with its iconic Saarinen table and the redone kitchen are these Mui pendants. They are beautiful in their transparency and simplicity. We designed this white oak hanging cabinet with open shelving and task lighting below. And the dazzling hand glazed ceramic backsplash adds dimensionality and visual excitement. I wonder what Colin's up to. This space used to be a two car garage and we reimagined it as a yoga studio and guest house building. We removed the garage doors and replaced them with this wall of glass that opens up onto this courtyard that we designed. And then we removed existing solid plywood and replaced them with this lightweight custom made steel truss. One of the fundamental principles of our practice is to connect indoors and outdoors, and we call that natural modernism. And that's also true in the way the main house was designed. Now it doesn't get more mid-century than a sunken family room. We brought a more contemporary feel to the space by wrapping the fireplace with these large porcelain slabs. We also hung these sleek starlight cable lights, which give the wood a more ethereal quality. And we kept the same language as the kitchen with these white oak cabinets. But here, it's really all about the views. Notice how the landscape steps down beyond the window in an almost seamless flow between architecture and nature. When I'm working with a client, to design their dream home, I love showing them this bedroom. I love its scale. I love the beautiful natural light that's coming in from the outside. It's actually only 10 feet wide, but it has an entire wall of glass. And again, this is a beautiful connection to nature. Imagine waking up first thing in the morning and looking out at this lovely forest setting. Our goal for this project was to restore this mid-century masterpiece and to adapt it to the needs of a growing young family. We achieved our goals by opening up the interiors, using innovative materials, and respecting the architecture of the home. I hope you enjoyed taking a look. And thanks for joining us. Well, that was so much fun, but the fun doesn't have to end here. Like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for the best open house has to offer.